Hi. Um, I have been obsessing over my new vanity space that I've been working on that um, I'm going to roll two videos into one. Um, the first thing that um, I want to need to talk about is um, something I wanted to share with you anyway, something that's my beauty secret and then a beauty tip that I think all girls need to know and it's eyebrows. Um, my beauty tip is always have them waxed. If you're not into beauty and you don't, not into beauty, if you're not into makeup yet, but um, you want to start, you want to start changing your look a little bit, go get your eyebrows waxed. Um, most places are, you know, will do a decent job, but try and find someone like of a friend that you know who has nice looking eyebrows and go to their lady or gentleman. Um, really important. Um, my secret is I have mine tattooed on. Um, not um, fully tattooed. There's still lots of hairs here, but you can kind of see the, the line and it goes to, it's up to here. Um, this one is colored in quite a bit. It was it ended over here and she drew it in there um, Of course for some reason that's where I'm growing white hairs So I don't know if that's from the tattooing or not, but um, When I go out and I put a lot of makeup on I still color in my eyebrows to make them a little bit darker um, Let's see. I use this brownish red color here. Um, it's not unique. It's just something I have and um color them in. It just, my, when I dyed my hair red, it was something I'm like, okay, well, I'll color in just a little bit. And it just makes such a statement. I love it. Just a little bit bolder. doesn't have to be perfect because when you're farther away, you're not going to see anything that you're going to be seeing when you're up this close. I have to color that front part in quite a bit more and this arch over here because it's just not it's not done. I am sitting on the floor currently. I can't wait. My chair is right next to me there, but I haven't been able to put it up yet. So, eyebrows, very important. Do them. Color them in. Um when you have light hair, you want to go a little bit darker with the color. Um dark eyes you can go dark but just don't go black because they're gonna look black uh, the next thing I need to talk about is contouring this is not something I do a lot of I don't have their kit so I'm just gonna use some different colors to show you a little bit of contouring um, if you're into it it's just a starter I know how to do it but I just don't I don't put on all that extra stuff. So I have two colors here. This I'm going to use to highlight my upper cheeks and this I'm going to use some contour and make some dark parts here to um, make it look like that. So the, the pink, I still make that fishy face. That was the pink on both sides and then the dark one. I'm still trying to do this in the video. It's not, <laughs> not what I want. So that's what I do. It looks a little funny here, but I'm going to blend it. The next thing I have, and if you there is um, a great product, I'll have to get the name of it for you. Um, but having so, a nice light color, put it under my eyes and down my nose. And sometimes if you put it right under here, it has a nice highlight too and above the eyebrows just for a little bit of contour. That you have to rub just gently with your hand. Text message from work. Not yet. Okay. So, got all that on. And now I'm going to blend. I think you're falling. Kind of looks like just a pink blob from there. <laughs> Doesn't look that like that from out here. There's a little bit dark spot here. You can always take a, um, a sponge and get away with any excess you don't want. That's just a little bit of contouring. And don't forget to do your eyebrows.